Hello everyone, happy holidays. How's it going everybody? It's Marky. I'm here to show you 50 Hot Wheels, the last 50 cars I bought. And I just want to show them really quickly because I haven't found anything else in the last couple of days. So I'm going to just show you all 50 of the last 50. <laughs> the last 50 Hot Wheels I bought, that's what I'm trying to say. Here's the Jaguar in purple. Really nice color for this one. Beautiful. And wow, this one is so beautiful. The Renault Sport RS. Really nice. Big wing in the back. Really nice uh, colors. Looks so good. I love the wheels. Nice blacked out wheels against the white. And all these colors here. It really looks good. I love it. I think it looks good in the white like this. Awesome. Can't wait to, to see more releases of this uh, car in other colors. Here's the Vulcan. Very cool in a metallic orange color. Big piece of glass here. Also a giant wing on the back. This one's in plastic though, this wing. Very cool. The Aston Martin Vulcan. So cool. What a beauty. Here's the front. And the side view. Wouldn't mind driving this one. <laughs> How about you? The Vulcan or this one? Which one would you take out for a drive? If you had a choice, you know, if you had a choice between this one or this one, <laughs> which one would you drive? The white one or the orange? You can only take one. Let's say, let's say, let's put you on the spot. You can only take one. And I also picked up this Viper just the other day. Can't complain. I do find a lot of Hot Wheels, but sometimes just dying to find some more. <laughs> 2013 Viper. Very cool. Very classic looking in the uh, blue and white. Blue with the white stripes. Very, very, very nice. And I also found this one recently. One of the last 50 Hot Wheels I've been able to pick up. With the uh, ketchup and mustard colors. Ketchup and mustard. Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. <laughs> and the Toyota Sprinter AE86 Sprinter Trino or Thunder is what that means. Beautiful. Oops. Ah. <clears throat> Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> and look at this. The Mod Rod in white with the orange. Orange flames. Red chrome on the wheels. Beautiful. He's another one of the last 50 cars that I had found. Mod Rod. Very cool. There's the front end. Nice. The Mighty K. Wow, what a beautiful little truck. The Mighty K. Look at that. Windshield wipers, mirrors. Very nice. Glass for the lights. Very cool. Skateboard. Can't go any anywhere without your skateboard. Spare tire and a toolbox. <laughs> Perfect. Very nice details on the back end of the Mighty K. Really cool little little wheels, little tires. The Mighty K. Nice. I love it. It's a beautiful little little truck. What else did I pick up? Ah, here it is. The Roadster Bite. The Roadster Bite. Best for track from the Speed Team. Very cool. 
Almost looks like a spaceship, right? Different paint job, and it could be flying next to Luke in a land speed in his land speeder. <laughs> Here we go. The Mazda rotary rotary engine pickup truck. Beautiful details on the front of the Mazda rotary engine. Love it. <clears throat> rotary power. Very nice. Love the back end here. Nice pipes. Beautiful. Have you had any luck finding this one? Let me know. Here's the Nash in the purple. We saw it in the light blue or the light green. Kind of like a teal color. Seafoam green, I think they call it. Very cool, the Nash. And it does have his name right there on the door, the Nash. Really cool. Look at the wheels on this one if you've never seen it before. Look at that. Skinny little wheels. <laughs> Skinny tires. <clears throat> the Nash. Right there. Cool, so now there's two variations of the Nash. And what do we have here? <clears throat> A Porsche. Beautiful. Little hatch right there. Nice. We do have the mirrors. We do have the uh, windshield wipers on there. Nice, beautiful stripes, vents. Really cool vents, the badge. Very nice. I was hoping for better wheels on this one. Don't really like the uh, gray against the red, but um, still a nice, uh, a nice one. Cool pipes on the back, really big uh, wing back here. There it is. I love this uh, little flare that it has down here. Really cool lines on this uh, Porsche. <clears throat> Porsche 935. What else do we have? What else do we have? Oh, wow, look at this. Bam, <laughs> you can make bubbles. Dip it in the soap, throw them down the track, and bubbles will come out as he flies down the track. Big giant wheel on the back. The Bubblematic is the name. There it is. <clears throat> Bubblematic. <coughs> really cool. I'm sure the kids are going to love it. Get to make bubbles and race down the track all at once. Pretty cool. And I love the dome on this one with the one seater inside. Pretty fun. What else do we have? Let's see. We have the... Ooh, Moon Eyes Bone Shaker. Bone Shaker with the Moon Eyes. Moon Equipment Company, Santa Fe Springs, California. <clears throat> Number 68 for the year Hot Wheels was introduced to the toy industry, or actually the year that it hit the shelves. And the skull on the front end there. Pretty cool grill there. Two-seater, you can take out your girlfriend. Really nice, bone shaker and a silver. Very, very cool. What's this? Ah, nice blue with the white wheels. Four-door car, license plate, Mercedes-Benz A-Class. We have the uh, wiper on the back, a couple of wipers in the front, mirrors on the side, big piece of glass, nice little wing right back here. Really cool details all around. Nice license plate, license plate. Exhaust on the sides. Really cool 10 spoke white wheels. I think they're 10s or 12s. Very, very nice. Look at that, you can see inside, bucket seats, left side driver. Very, very nice. Beautiful blue color with the white stripe. Can't beat that. That's a really nice combination. I'm glad they went with the white and not that gray like they did on the Porsche. Cause it looks really cool with the white white wheels <coughs> excuse me and the manga tuner the orange version now i have three different manga tuners i have the pink and the purple and now the orange very cool i think this is, these are the only three that have been made i believe these three colors and this orange one looks really really good nice uh blue manga tuner name right there nice uh, blue running boards and little blue spoiler in the front very cool look at the exhaust giant exhaust in the back very very nice manga tuner 
and we have the minecart minecraft <laughs> minecraft minecart minecart right there the minecart pretty cool and it's been out in a few other colors or at least one other color that i know of the bone shaker the baja bone shaker this one they just add the Baja to the front of the name. Baja Bone Shaker, as you can see right there. Big rugged tires on this one. Very, very cool. Hey guys, if you've uh, enjoyed the video so far, subscribe to the channel. That helps the channel stick around, gives it life. And thank you guys. Thank you for subscribing. Big pipe on the back on this one. This is a Volkswagen tuned Volkswagen, which means like it looks like a cartoon car. Hot Wheels logo, really cool. Number 68 again on the door for the year Hot Wheels began its career. <laughs> tuned VW Golf MK1. <clears throat> the VW Golf MK1. Nice bucket seats inside. Really tall roof up here. Very nice. It's cool that they're giving us a lot of new tuned cars so it's not just the one hot wheels metro racing fuel look at this guy this guy looks like he's gonna haul down the road i'm telling you you can't if you need gasoline you're gonna have to really step on it to catch this guy we need gasoline we need fuel <laughs> nice blue fenders against the orange that looks really good the chrome looks really cool forgot the name of this one. Oh, the fast gas in yeah, I was saying, he looks fast. The fast gassing. Another fun Hot Wheels design. And then we have, ooh, the Honda. Everybody loves the Honda City Turbo 2. 85 Honda City Turbo 2. And this is the new color for 2022 so far. Hopefully they'll recolor it before the year is over, uh, 2022. And they'll have a two different ones or maybe three. That would be cool. It's so popular that maybe we'll have, who knows, maybe three different colors for the year. That's upcoming year. But yeah, this is new for uh, 2022. It's already been released now in December of 2021. But it is a A-case car or the first case of Hot Wheels for 2022. And it's called A-case. And... B case is out because I found two bait uh, B case cars. I haven't opened those yet. Just remembered that <clears throat> I forgot about those two BK cars. B case cars I found. Um, the B case cars came and went. I got there late and there was only two on the pegs and I was like, no matter what they are, I'm taking them. <laughs> I gotta have some B case cars in my hands. All right, so this one is a '67 Chevelle Super Sport, 396. Beautiful in yellow, and we saw this one in blue not too long ago. Really cool recolor in yellow with the Osley's 40 Years Chevelle logo right on the door. And I love these uh, flags up here. Hot Wheels logo. Beautiful stripes on this one. So nice. So nice. Super Sport right there on the back fender. Great looking back end, just like the old cars had all that chrome. Beautiful. It's a beauty. All right. And look at this. We have the power wagon with the muddy wheels in orange. This is a Dodge. Where's the name? Oh, right there. 1970 Dodge power wagon. There, you can see it now, right? Very cool. Got some garbage on there. Number 70 on the doors. Hot Wheels logo in black and white. Really cool. Goodyear. Logo, Dodge logo, man, all these stripes and colors, so cool, nice light bar, really cool lights up here in the front, man, so nice, Dodge Power Wagon, this one is a beauty, I love it, and look at this, the Corvette Greenwood, looking cool with the blacked out wheels and the chrome stripe around the edges, very nice, look at the exhaust popping out through the sides, right by the door and where's the name on this one they didn't put the name on there where i don't see it well anyways guys it's the, it's the uh 
Corvette Greenwood. Thank God I remember the name on this one. Number 22 on the doors with the Hot Wheels logo right over that first two. That looks sweet. I love that Hot Wheels logo on there. Goodyear logo looking good. A couple more logos. Really cool glass for the for the lights in the front. 22 right there. That looks nice. Very cool. I do have a little damage on my stripe here. But what a beauty. This one's out in light blue and in gold. And hmm, can't remember if there was another color on this one. For some reason I want to say white, but I'm not sure. So let's not say I said white. <laughs> and uh, oh, forgot the name of this one. Let's go. Just like the car song. And she says, let's go. Down, 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 down. I like the nightlife, baby. She says, <laughs> why am I singing, guys? Right on. Let's go. Down, down, down. Oh, yeah. I love the cars. First of all, they're called the cars. The band is called the cars. You know? Wow. Too bad we lost two of the members of the band already. So sad. But uh, what a great band, the cars. I love their songs. Really cool logo here, Hot Wheels. Let's go. Very cool. All right, check this out. Wow. <laughs> this would be fun to drive too. Can I borrow it for the weekend? What's this one called? I forgot already. Is it? Oh, wow. The Bogzilla. I almost called it by the wrong name. The Bogzilla. Bogzilla. I was going to call it the Power Hog. <laughs> and then I remember, no, no, that's that. That's the Action Man vehicle from England, from the UK, the UK toys. The Power Hog. Very cool. Look at that giant steering wheel. Pretty fun. Red wheels on this one. Big black rugged tires, chrome base. This one feels like it has like no die cast to it. I think this is all plastic. I don't know. The Power Hog. And what else do we have? Look at this. The Rebel Ram 1500. 2020 Ram 1500 Rebel. Silver. Do have the uh, little antenna and the big uh, sunroof up there. A couple of wipers here. No mirrors on the side. Four-door vehicle, but no, no mirrors. Plastic and die cast in the bed. Really cool lights on the back. Love the Ram name back there on the uh, gate. Very cool. A little spot for the license plate. Exhaust on the bottom. Two, two pipes showing. A little, what looks like a spare tire down there. I don't know. I don't know if that's just a coincidence. We do have a gas, gasoline access right there. Cool stripes. Ram. 1500 in silver. Metallic silver. With all the black accents. Looking really good. We can see inside really well with all that light coming in. Even though all the windows are rolled up. It looks really nice, really, really nice. All right, and then we have a beautiful Porsche in white with the black and red stripes. Really cool lights in the front, nice badge. Windshield wiper, mirrors, big wing on the back, cool wheels, blacked out. Usually you see these in chrome, but uh, blacked out, five spokes. Hot Wheels logo on the door. Some really nice stripes on the bottom here. Kind of plain on the back, all white. And then we have the two um, pipes showing there. Very cool. This one is... Is there no name on this one? Wow, no name. Well, I know it's a Porsche. I just can't remember the the uh, the numbers right now for this one. As it happens when you're on camera, you forget everything. <laughs> forget how to talk. <laughs> everything goes out the door, out the window. And here we have the Supra in yellow, Toyota Supra. 2020 Toyota GR Supra in yellow. This one's available in white as well. Blacked out wheels, looks really cool. So you have a white one you can find. You can find this yellow one, really nice lights on this one in the front. Cool Toyota badge right in the middle. Nice spoiler down here in the front. So cool, I love the giant wing back here. The pipes, little spot for the license plate. I wish they had painted in the brake lights. Really cool. Looks like you're in a in an aircraft, this little or a spaceship or something. Really cool uh, 
what do you call this here? Like a cabin or something? Has that dome effect, like, you know? Very nice. Beautiful car. It's got to be fast. It looks like it's fast. And then we have the Speedster. Two-seater, left side driver, a couple of mirrors on the side, no windshield. And Aston Martin V12 Speedster. Man, V12. <clears throat> wow. And there it is. V12 Speedster right on the license plate. Aston Martin logo up there with the wings. Very nice. Two pipes showing here. Very, very cool. Really nice color too. It's got like a light bluish color in there. It's like a silver with a blue, a hint of blue in there, a hint of a gunmetal kind of kind of thing. A well, gunmetal, I think, is much darker, right? This is like a lighter. Okay, I stand corrected. I think that's not the right description, but it's a nice uh, metallic color. And then we have, you can compare, see how it has like a little, little bit of a blue in there. Really nice. And then we have this <clears throat> beauty, beautiful uh, Audi. Look at that. Front end looks beautiful. A couple of windshield wipers back there, and we have the mirrors on the side. <clears throat> Something going on here, some roof racks. Action, a little antenna with the uh, wing back here. Four door wagon. We do have another wiper back here. Audi logo, a couple of uh, things going on there. Two pipes over here, beautiful lights. You have the brake lights, the uh, reverse lights in white, and the parking lights. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful car. This one is available in a really, really nice uh, glossy blue color. So you can find it in blue. And it's called the 94 Audi Avant RS2. And there's the name again. What a beauty tell you i have bought a lot of nice cars the last 50 cars are pretty nice wow here's the hotbird hotbird looking really good in this uh, nice uh, metallic dark blue color with the gold stripes and the bird right there in the wing trans am name right there in the corner trans am trans am right here on the side gold stripe on the wheel the bird up here on the side Right behind the driver and right behind the passenger. Of course, only a two-door car with the T-tops. The stripes go all the way to the back. I like that. We needed some color for the lights. And then we need a license plate. But uh, everything else looks really good. Very nice. Check out the stripe on the bottom. Just really, really, really cool. I love it. And then we have, ooh, the Ford. Nice. <clears throat> Let's get the name right. 2017 Ford GT. And a number four on the door. Really cool with the white wheels. Match the stripes really well. Looks so good. Number four in gold and then in black on the top here. We do have gold and white stripes. <clears throat> then uh, the white stripes and then they turn into gold towards the back. Not turn into gold. They get a little outline in gold. Very cool. Wow, very nice. Big windshield wipers on this one. No mirrors on the side. Do have some really cool looking lights and a nice badge in the front, nice Ford badge with that stripe that comes to a point there, a couple of stripes there. Beautiful vents. Nice, nice, nice. Hot Wheels logo on the doors in gold. The black background. All black down in the back. And some nice details in the front, even has little stripes here. They start over here, go all the way up. Very cool. Nice combo. I love the metallic black with all the white uh, details on this one. Looks really cool. And we have <clears throat> a Skyline. Let me say hello to Cadester, who loves the Skyline. He's one of my, uh, one of my subs. Cadester, go and uh, check out his channel and... Join Cadester on his adventures collecting Hot Wheels. Right uh, side driver, no mirrors on the side on this one. Beautiful Skyline though, Skyline 2000. Where's the name, where's the name? I don't see the name on here, so. I can't, 
can't say uh, if is this called the Skyline 2000? I can't remember right now. Nissan, no GTR, GTR. Um, I don't know. I I forget everything when I'm when I'm recording, guys. <laughs> it's not the 34. What do they call it? GTR. Right side driver. No mirrors, like I said. No windshield wipers. Really cool front end. I love it. Love the spoiler here. Looks really good. Really nice details on the uh, lights and the uh, grill, even though there are no extra colors. Two-door car. We do have the lock and key or the keyhole and the uh, handle the, on the uh, door. And the little Hot Wheels logo in the corner of the doors. Skyline name in the back. There's a few really cool details on this one. Really nice in the exhaust right there. Check it out. Really, really nice. I love the color on this one. It looks a lot like uh, the Speedster. Let's see. No, not quite the same. More towards the gray. This one more towards the blue. Very, very nice. And we have, wow, look at this one. This one really pops. What a color. The uh, Acura NSX. And there's the Acura badge. We do have the windshield wipers on there. Big piece of glass. Very nice. Cool badge, the lights, nice grill. Very, very cool lights, look at that. Sweet. Nice wheels on this one in the chrome. This green color is just amazing on Hot Wheels. It looks really good on Hot Wheels. I don't know if it, look, it would look this good on a uh, real life car, but I would have to see one to, to know. But uh, as a Hot Wheels, it looks really cool. Thought this was glass. This might just be a painted uh, roof in black. Two-door car, no mirrors on the side, and it's marked 2017 Acura NSX. Can you see that there? Very very cool. And then we got a Pagani. I say Hira. Some say Waira. I just say Hira all the time for some reason. That's how it comes out. Pagani Hira. <laughs> And it's got the gold with the black accents. Very beautiful. There's the Hyra name or the Waira. Why, Ra? Why, why? <laughs> no name down here. Oh, yeah, it is. It's right there. It is here. Pagani, Waira, or Hyra. All right, so this time I, I remembered to call it both of the names just in case. And it is a left side driver. No mirrors on the side. No windshield wipers that I can see. It's got something going on here. Can't tell exactly how that works. Very, very nice. This one just looks fast. Very cool. Very cool. <clears throat> and this one is the Cobra in red. Check out these wheels. And the pipes on the side here by the door. Seat belts on the seats there. Very cool. Nice glass with the windshields, uh, I mean the wipers, windshield wipers right in there. Molded on the glass there, you can see that. Right too close, yeah, right there. And got a little badge in the middle, those beautiful white stripes. It's really cool. Really cool Cobra. I have a collection of Cobras. I have a bunch of different ones. I gotta show them all together so you can see the differences and look at this the f1 the f1 looks really 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 nice big giant one uh, windshield wiper on there look at that nice big glass so one seat right there in the middle see the the dashboard there just one seat in the middle with the uh, steering wheel right in the middle pretty cool Almost like that go-kart feeling, right? Look at the back. Four pipes showing there. Some nice details, a little grill, and we have all those lights and little, little black and silver details. Very, very nice. Very cool. I really love this one. McLaren F1. Chrome wheels on it. Very nice. And let's see what we have here. Oh, wow. 1970. An oldie, but a goldie. 
Beautiful blue enamel on this one with the white stripes. Nice uh, blue interior, which I haven't seen much of lately. Really cool blue interior. 1970 Camaro RS. 1970 Camaro. <coughs> Excuse me. All blue in the back. Kind of needed a little license plate or something on there. Some lights in red. Look cool. The lights are also blue in the front. Wish they had painted those and the grill in black or something. Do have the silver locks. That's really cool. No mirrors on the side. No windshield wipers. Very cool. Big, tall tires in the back. I love that. Look at that. Nice scoop on the hood. Really nice, classic, vintage uh, vehicle right here. Hot Wheels logo on the fenders in the back. Big black spoiler in the front. And it looks really good. You can find this one in orange and probably a couple other colors. And here's the Mustang. Wow, what a beauty. This one was out in purple not long ago. <clears throat> and here it is in black with the gold and the gray stripes. Hot Wheels logo all the way in the back fender. No mirrors on the side. No windshield wipers. Blacked out on the front end. Big scoops up here. Nice hood. Look at that. Really cool hood. Very nice. And we do have, bam, little wing back here. Hot Wheels uh, logos on the back fender again, both sides. Gray wheels on this one, taller tires on the back, and big fat ones, big fat ones on the back. The 1967 Ford Mustang GT. Very, very nice. Wow, very cool. What else do we have? The N600, little Honda N600, beautiful lights. I found another one and I bought it, so now I have this one with the damaged light. I have one that I that I uh, bought. Oh, here it is. Found one the other day, so now I have one with better lights. I haven't opened it yet, but uh, now I'm gonna have a better one. It's a little better because it really bugged me that the lights are all scratched up. So pretty cool. I have this one in that uh, cream color that was issued before this one. The cream color does only have one mirror on, on the left side only. Nothing over here. You can see that. And it has what looks like a little antenna, I think, or something. Maybe a light. I'm not sure. That's a little light or an antenna. We do have the windshield wipers. Beautiful grill with the lights. Look at that. Honda badge in the middle. The front end looks really good. Nice uh, nice spoiler on the bottom too. Blacked out wheels. It's only a two-door two car. We do have the gasoline access. The uh, handles are painted over in blue. There's a steering wheel on the left side there. And then again, on the back end, we do have a lot of colors. And the exhaust showing right here on this side right here. Very cool. Little Honda. Custom 1970 Honda N600. There's a name. Just in case you don't understand me. <laughs> Which is very possible, right? And we do have little triangle windows. The windows are rolled down, but here in the back, they're all up. Beautiful little Honda. I love it. I love it in this uh, color. Really nice. And what do we have here? The IROC Z. Recently out in the really beautiful red, translucent red color. Now in the blue with the glossy blue stripe. Really fat, glossy blue stripe. I don't think I've seen this combination out there on the road, but uh, pretty nice. Look at the black vents there. Nice dashboard, left side driver. No mirrors on the side. No windshield wipers. Do have the Hot Wheels logo back here on the fender. Very cool. Gasoline access. And that hatch hatchback... Uh, Back end here with the glass. All this opens up, I believe. Very cool. The lights are not painted or anything. We do have that beautiful stripe on the bottom with the silver IROC Z and the Z28 right there. Looks like it says 5.5.0 liter, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. So far, which one's your favorite, guys? Let me know if you have a few favorites. Let me know which ones are your favorites out of this whole pile of 50 Hot Wheels. Here's the Draftnator pickup truck. It's 
Got like a purple paint stripe there on the tires, on the wheels, I mean, on the rims. Very, very nice. Really cool combination of colors. Kind of like a purple pink and a light blue and then the darker blue, which is like a see-through plastic. Very interesting how you can see all that chrome inside. Big exhaust on the sides. Look at that. Very nice. Big chrome front end there with the big lights. And there's no sign for lights back here. Big wing on the back. Beautiful uh, graphics on the side. Number two on the door. A couple of logos down here. Very, very nice. And do you know who this is right here? What does that RYU stand for? Vroom, vroom, vroom. Let me know. Liberty Walk. Nice package on this one. Look at this. This one's also out in blue. Oh, it has something on there. Oh, it's like a hair. Very, very nice. Wow. Beautiful back end on this one. Nice, nice, big, giant wing. I love all the Liber Liberty Walk um, uh, details on this. This whole package is just amazing. Wow. Blacked out wheels. Looking really cool. Got cool mirrors on the side. Two-door car, of course. Nice lights on the back. GTR. Wow. What a beauty. Nissan. LB Silhouette. Works GT, Nissan 35 GT RR version 2. Man, this is a beautiful car. Look at that wing. The Liberty Walk treatment. It is a right side driver, not like we drive in America. We would be driving over here, except for our mailman. He drives on that side. <laughs> Here's another red one. Honda Prelude, black hood. Little mirrors on the side. We do have the uh, windshield wipers giving a lot of detail on this one. Little antenna on the back with that really cool sunroof. Honda Prelude. Nice badge in the front. Look at the fog lights, grill, these cool lights. Man, really nice front end on this one. Looks really cool. White wheels on it. Honda Prelude name down back there. Really beautiful lights. Little something else going on over here. Really cool pipes showing here. What do we have? Honda Prelude. 1998 Honda Prelude. Very nice. There's the exhaust. So cool. Beautiful. And then we have the Lightning pickup truck. Wow. Ford Lightning. We do have those side view mirrors. Windshield wipers. Beautiful lights. Look at that. They look so realistic. Don't they? They did a great job on those lights. Really, really, really nice lights. Great, great job with the highlights and the darkness. And they just look real. Nice Ford badge there on the grill. It looks really cool. Beautiful lightning in red. This one's out in gold as well, so you can get a gold one. A metallic gold color. But this red one, I think, might be my favorite out of the two. Out of the gold and the red, I think this one. It does have the little lightning badge right there wow so cool a lot of little details on this little Ford Lightning great job on this one and what do we have here pickup truck wow very nice only two doors with the extended uh, small cab there Chevy Silverado Yellow with the black stripes. White stripe on the bottom with the BF Goodridge logo there. Hot Wheels logo on the back fender. We do have the red lights painted in the brake lights. Very cool. The front is all plastic. Uh, all the lights are detailed on here. Sides. And then we have the Chevy, Chevrolet logo or the Chevy logo right there in the middle. Windshield wipers. No mirrors. And we do have the white stripes and the black stripe in the middle. Man, it looks cool. Very good combination of colors with the gray wheels. It looks really good. And what do we have here? Nice. This looks really beautiful. Wow. 
just like you see them on the road. RX-7, Mazda RX-7, 89 Mazda Savannah RX-7. Got the uh, exhaust pipes there on the sides, on the back. Very, very nice. Black interior. It looks so cool. Awesome. This one is also available in other colors. I believe there's a red one, and I can't remember. Some other colors. Very nice. And check this out. I love this Land Rover. So awesome. The Range Rover Classic by Land Rover. So it's a Range Rover by Land Rover. There it is. Range Rover Classic. Beautiful. Big windshield wiper on the top there on the glass. Lots of logos and paint for the lights. Beautiful on the sides. Really cool. Plastic on the front end here. Number 81. Beautiful. Looks like it says Terrain Challenge. Wow. Very, very nice. Little something going on there. A couple of mirrors on the side. It's a beauty. It's a beauty. Love it. And number 50 in this beautiful green color. Look at this four door car or four door uh, pickup truck with the big Ford logo back here. The 2019 Ford Ranger Raptor. Ford Ranger Raptor. Beautiful. No lights on the back showing there. And I think this is like some damage I got there. I don't know. That's how it came. Mirrors on the side. No windshield wiper. Big fat stripe here with a couple of outlines. And look at this. A little more detail on this side. With the red and the gray. Got these ridges up here, side view mirrors, Ford logo on this big stripe. Beautiful, Ford Performance Hot Wheels. Very, very nice, the Raptor. Very cool. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, the last 50 Hot Wheels I bought. Let's see what we can find in, ne in the uh, next coming weeks. I can't wait to bring you some new Hot Wheels. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video.